If you're like me and you use FaceTime a lot to keep in touch with friends, family and even colleagues sometimes, then the great thing about iOS 14, if you're using it on the iPhone or on the iPad, is now you can do other things when you're using FaceTime and still see the call. So here's what I mean. So I'm just going to do a FaceTime call. I'm going to call my wife Lisa and I'm just going to do that. So it's now ringing. She's just over there just for convenience. We're just going to Hello. mute. There she is. Hello. <laughs> she's right over here, which is just great because she's behind the camera doing all the bits. And you can see it's got the normal sort of thing. It's got Lisa here and she just needs to move the camera so not so much space above the top of her head. That's better. And you've got me in here. Now, if you've got the iPhone or the iPad that's got the home button, you just press it. And if you've got one that you swipe up, you just swipe up. And have a look at that. I can now still see Lisa and I can go and do other things like take notes, go to email and so on. And I can just slide around so that she's on different parts of the screen. Now, for some of you, you may have realized that when you're looking at FaceTime, it comes up saying paused because the other person has gone to do something else, but you can still hear them. Well, now Lisa doesn't see the paused on there anymore. So as I said, I can go to say a website here and I could go and find something and you know, then talk to Lisa about it. So aside from being able to move it around the screen, I can also slide it if it's on the right hand side of the screen here, I can slide it over to the right and you see it just becomes a little arrow on the side here. To get Lisa back, I just tap on that. Now when it's slid, slud over to the side, then the thing that you've got is so you may be hearing an echo with this, it, she will see it as paused. Now if it's on the left hand side of the screen, whether it's the top or the bottom, I can slide over there again so I can see more of what is going on on the screen. But this is really useful. And if I want it to go back to full screen, I just tap on it, it takes me back to the FaceTime that you're familiar with. So here it is, the great thing about iOS 14, if you're doing a FaceTime call, you are not losing your connection, you can still see whoever you are talking to. So this is really great. There are lots of other things about iOS 14 that are really nice. If you like them, there's more on my channel. If you do like this, please like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching. <laughs>